Hi. My name is <laughs> Catherine Coster. Catherine Coster, and we are welcoming you to Queller Prep Tutoring Educational Center's number one top rated video of 2010. No, we're kidding. <laughs> Catherine, 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 we have so many questions for you. First, uh, Catherine, how do you get a perfect score? How do you get a perfect score in your SATs? 800 verbal, 800 math, 800 writing. How do you prepare for a 2400 in the SAT? You have to do the work. <laughs> you have to do the work. It's that easy, huh? Yeah. And I need more information. What do you do? How do you get that kind of score? A perfect score. You are my mother's dream child. <laughs> Tell me more. What do you do? What do you do? How do you get it? I use the college board book um, because it has the questions that are written by the actual... The college board blue book. Okay, yes. I'm video... Ooh, that, that's the blue book right there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what else do you do from there? Um, what else? I like the blue book because it's actually, <laughs> okay. it's got the questions written by the people who write the SAT. Um, I looked at other books like Princeton. Which so what you're good. essentially saying is you've used the original questions? Yes. Okay. Um, and I would study every week, if not every day, trying to set aside time with all doing all my schoolwork and doing after school activities, but really making the SAT and the PSAT a priority. Why would you make the SAT and PSAT a priority? Because you need, that's the first thing colleges look at when that's they're That's the first at thing colleges look at. A lot of times kids come to Quality Prep and they think to themselves, oh, I don't know, school told me SAT is not as important. They look at other stuff. On a scale of 1 to 10, how important would you say the SAT test is? 10, 11. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. And I also see you took the American History Regions, the Physics Regions, the Calculus, I'm sorry, the AP Examinations. What did you score? What did you get? Fives. Five, five, five. How do you get fives? How do you get perfect scores in all these exams? A lot of hard work. Um, so you're telling me it didn't come easily? No. <laughs> okay, what did you do? How did you prepare for the SAT while preparing for the AP examinations wow. and scoring so well? Um, How did you juggle? I, I didn't get much sleep. <laughs> but basically just I knew how important it was and that kind of motivated me to stay up, do the work, um, and also I had a good support system. My my parents were very encouraging. My friends were also kind of in the same mindset. Oh, Queller Prep is also quite encouraging. Okay. <laughs> all right. Um, but my friends were all kind of in the same echelon and we all were trying to get into really good schools together. So it wasn't like they were peer pressuring me to come out and have fun with them when I wasn't supposed to be. It was like we all knew like, okay, we have to do homework tonight. Um, we have to work and we have yeah. to study. That's excellent. Catherine, do you have any um, good luck wishes for anyone? Do you want to tell the group behind you any words of wisdom before we uh, <laughs> conclude this video? Um, I hope you guys all do really well on your tests and just even when you feel like it's getting too hard and you're hitting a plateau and you can't get higher, you will. Just keep working because you might be at the same score for like couple weeks and then all of a sudden you'll jump up like 50 or 100 points and you didn't think it was going to happen but it will just keep working at it thank you so much